Armenia governorate had enjoyed lately its importance being the focus of media attention on both the local and the international levels. That's a natural outcome of the important archaeological discoveries in many areas in the governorate, like the area of Tuna Jabal, where the first human ancient cemetery in Middle Egypt had been found. A big number of mummies, reaching 28 mummies, were found. In the area of El Ghuraifa, four kilometers away from Tuna Jabal, which name differentiates it from Tuna Al Balad, a monumental cemetery was found. The cemetery belongs to family tombs that date to the end of the pharaonic times and the beginning of the Ptolemic era. Amongst its main components, coffins of the priests of Gadjehuti and a big number of the statues of the servants known as Ushapti, made of blue faience, and four jars known as the Canopic jars, made of alabaster in a very good condition, with lids that have the faces of the four children of Horus, Duamut F, Kabahsinu F, MST and Habi. These are the jars which contain the inner organs of the deceased. According to the ancient Egyptian creed, they are as important as the body itself and needed in the resurrection of the afterlife. A scarab that's very unique was also found. Over it there was a message encrypted in ancient Egyptian language saying, Happy New Year. In addition to a collection of blue faience and red rubies and ribbons of thin bronze that are gilded and represent the sons of Horus. A mask made of bronze coated with a layer of gilded plaster was found. Scarabs made of semi-precious stones were found in addition to 40 coffins cut of limestone varied in shapes and sizes, some of which have the human figure and decorated with hieroglyphic carvings and a number of wooden sarcophagi. It wouldn't be an exaggeration to say that Egypt is floating over a sea of monuments and the dawn of every new day holds revealings of the treasures that still lie in the bottom of the ground waiting for the glorious moments of their discovery.